Hi, this is Presh Talwalkar, and today I'm going to explain the rule of 72, which is a formula for how fast your investment will double. The formula is that 72 divided by the rate of return is the time for your investment to double. We can go through some examples. Let's say your rate of return is 3% and you want to know how long it takes to double. The rule of 72 says if you take 72 divided by 3, the answer is 24. So investing at 3% will take about 24 years to double. If you have a rate of return of 4%, we can take 72 divided by 4, and that gives us 18 years. Other examples are with the rate of return of 6%, it'll take you 12 years. With 8%, it'll take you 9 years. And with 12%, it'll take you 6 years for your investment to double. While the rule of 72 is very popular, there are some important, important things to remember. First of all, it's an approximate formula, and although it's accurate, it is still an approximation. It's only going to work for returns between about 4% and 18%. And most importantly, the rule of 72 will not work if you keep investing every month or every year. And it also requires a constant return every year. So if you have a return of 10% one year, 5% another year, you know, negative, 3% another year, the rule of 72 is not a good guide. It has to work with a constant return. So it annoys me to no end, the rule of 72 is always mentioned by investment advisors and financial analysts, and it's simply not suitable for investing in the stock market. So my bit of advice is if you ever meet with someone who tries to manage your money and they tell you about the rule of 72, just walk out because it does not work. The stock market has unpredictable returns that change every year. So why does the rule of 72 even work? It has to do with the formula for compound interest. If you invest P dollars at a rate of annual rate of return of R for T years, the amount of money you'll end up with is P times 1 plus R to the T. What we want to do is we want to say, how long will it take for the money to double? So we now have an equation that says if you invest P, we want to solve for the time T that you'll end up with 2P. So the first thing we'll do is we'll cancel out the P's. From here, we'll take the natural log of both sides. And we're almost done. We have a linear equation in T. and uh, we're almost at the rule of 72, so we'll need a couple of approximations. First of all, the natural log of 2 is about 70%, and we will round that to 72% because 72 has a lot more divisors. The other trick is that the natural log of 1 plus r is approximately equal to r, uh, when r is between 4 and 18%. So if r is 5%, the natural log of 1 plus 5% is about 5%. So using these approximations, we have that t times r is 72, and that means the time to double is equal to 72 divided by the rate of return. And that's the derivation for the rule of 72. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my channel. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions, or on Twitter at Presh Talwalker.